Weren't they discontinued? Tell me the whole story. Pretty much everyone has heard of Wendy's, and everyone knows about their most popular items, like the Baconator and Frosty. But what about the foods that Wendy's let fade away? Here are 10 discontinued Wendy's items we desperately miss the most. Tell them that I miss them. Frescata Deli Sandwiches. My sheets look like what they wrap deli sandwiches in. First of all, Wendy's is a fast food chain. You usually think burgers, fries, Frosty. But that wasn't always the case. Accompanied by salads, the favorite fast food chain used to have Frescata Deli Sandwiches. These slider-like handhelds were piled high with sliced meat, veggies, and occasionally your choice of sauce. They were a wonderful option for when you were craving something other than a burger. These were essentially Wendy's attempt at making deli sandwiches a menu staple. I'm trying. They were said to have been trying to expand in a new direction at this time, with higher quality meats and fresh sauces and artisan bread. Unfortunately, the lure of things like the Baconator and the classic chicken sandwich were too much, and these little sandwiches got knocked off the table. This is a sad turn of events for those who are looking to eat cheap and healthy, but there's always other options on the Wendy's menu. Coffee Toffee Twisted Frosty Frosty Chocolate Milkshakes this fantastic frozen coffee drink was perfect for any time of day. If you were ordering it in the morning, the tongue twister of a name may be a bit too much. If you were on your way to work, a boring meeting, coming home from a trip, or just love yourself a good cup of joe, the Coffee Toffee Twisted Frosty was made for you. <laughs> That's cute. The amazing buttery flavor of the toffee cut any bitterness of the coffee, and the blend of ice cream and coffee is a mix that can never go wrong. The drink was only around for a short two years, and wouldn't one of these sound good right now? The good news is Wendy's does currently offer a Frosty Chino. Not exactly the same, but should scratch a similar itch. Gouda Bacon Cheeseburger Right, one bacon cheeseburger. The next desperately missed Wendy's item on the list is the Melty Gouda Bacon Cheeseburger. It was too Gouda to be true, apparently. In 2016, this and the Gouda Bacon Fries were short-lived and well-loved. Truly a cheese lover's dream come true, this burger featured a slice of the namesake hot Melty Gouda cheese, a special Swiss Gruyere cheese sauce, garlic aioli, crispy bacon, and a quarter pound of beef all on a brioche bun. And two buns! This thing was just mouth-watering and made this sandwich one of the most exquisite things to ever grace Wendy's menu. Wendy's made the odd decision to use a heavily sports-themed marketing campaign when promoting the Bacon Gouda burger. This may have led to its downfall, as well as the unique nutty flavor not being appealing enough to the average consumer, and so it inevitably melted off the menu. OG French fries. I said French fries! Though they struck gold with the original recipe, Wendy's fries were subject to a makeover. Fast food is all about demand, and the customers let the restaurant know what they wanted. In the 90s, fat-free food was the topic of the day, and fast food restaurants had to adapt. Though it's a lot harder to make authentic junk food without fat, Wendy's managed the transition by altering the way they prepare their fries. They did this by going from using a combination of different oils to using pure vegetable oil in their fryers. Though these fries are still delicious, they're not the same as they once were. At this point, every fast food chain has changed up the recipe and makeup of their fries, mostly for the better. They changed it. Change it back. But we really think Wendy's would do itself a favor by going back to the original fries everyone loved. There will always be a debate on which fast food restaurant has the best fries. But if we're being honest, Wendy's current fries are rarely talked about as being in the same league as McDonald's or even Arby's for that matter. Fries will always be a classic addition to any fast food order and that's never going away. But Wendy's could make it an even tastier addition by going back to their original fries. But maybe there are those who like the new Wendy's fries better. Let us know what you think in the comments below. 
Pretzel Pub Burger. This is pretzel day. This menu item had the not-so-special privilege of being discontinued not once, but twice. A unique pretzel bun and gooey beer cheese sauce combo with a burger patty and the works and toppings, the Pretzel Pub Burger was something a lot of the world just wasn't ready for. When this creation came out, people were wary of it. Wendy's took a huge leap of faith by using the untraditional pretzel dough for a burger bun. It was risky, but it absolutely paid off in producing a delicious and very different make of burger. The Pretzel Pub Burger created a a dedicated following of fans. Inspired by the German celebration Oktoberfest, the combination of soft pretzels and a beer cheese, much like in a traditional fondue, was an unusual but winning burst of flavors. Oh, so many flavors! However, it may have been too exotic of an experiment for the typical American palate. It was actually one of the most successful limited-time offerings in Wendy's history upon first release, though it still disappeared from the menu. But customers demanded its return, and it was brought back and even added as a permanent menu item, though this was short-lived. Within a year, it was eventually axed once again from the Wendy's fast food menu lineup, this time for good. Chicken Caesar Wrap All of us love chicken. This saucy, protein and veggie-filled fan favorite popped up in the early 2000s when it was customary for every restaurant to put out something wrapped in a delicious bread blanket. Whether it was pita bread, tortillas, or flatbread, these new handheld sandwiches were cult classics. Wendy's dipped its feet in the game with their Chicken Caesar Pita Wrap. This newfangled meal, along with the Frescata sandwiches, was one of the fresher, greener items on the Wendy's menu and brought in a whole new type of customer. Aimed more towards the lunch crowd, looking for something different, this pita-wrapped meal was a big hit for Wendy's. Everybody loves it. Everybody hates it. Fans described it as having a salad that tastes great, and then they make it portable with bread around it. How could you go wrong with that? There were other flavors offered of the pita wraps, but the chicken Caesar pita was by far the most popular, making it all the more surprising, more like an unexpected stab in the back, when Wendy's chicken Caesar wraps were taken off the permanent menu, despite fans clamoring for more. The Queso Trio. Queso. Queso who? Queso fries, queso burger, and queso chicken sandwich. These were the three all-new menu items dropped by Wendy's, much to the delight of queso lovers everywhere. And of course, all are topped with a generous sprinkle of bacon bits or slices, because well, why not? What goes better with cheese than bacon? All three of these menu items were a huge, smashing success in the middle of the 2010s when topping anything edible with hot queso sauce was the biggest thing to hit the food industry. The burger and chicken sandwich also had a slice of cheese added to the mix, because more cheese is always a good thing, right? Yeah, you're right. No matter how much of a mess it made of your car or what stains it left on your jeans, these drippy cheese items were a guaranteed satisfactory lunch, snack, or dinner. These queso-fueled items were always marketed as limited-time only menu items, but everyone was sure something so good would stick around for the long haul. But alas, it disappeared off the menu as planned. We've healed and continued to eat, but we never forgot the cheesy goodness. Spicy Nuggies here are the Nuggies! Currently only available at certain locations around the U.S., one of Wendy's more popular items was already yanked once. It's possible they might not be around for much longer and become lost to the void of all good things. Spicy chicken nuggets will always be an item fans want. Wendy's once had this market cornered, but when they started to secretly pull them off their menu, Burger King noticed. 
So BK started making their own spicy chicken nuggets and vowed to give anyone legally named Wendy a free order of their nuggets. Now that's Burger King taking a serious shot at Wendy's. Oh yeah, it's like a big deal. However, with the release of the new ghost pepper sauce at Wendy's, the duo of spicy chicken nuggets or the original variety will hopefully be burning mouths for years to come. There is a spicy food craze all across the world right now, and with TikTok trends and food enthusiasts diversifying their daily menus, people are appreciating spice and begging companies to bring the heat. Their fast food competitors have tried to claim fame when it comes to their spicy chicken items, but Wendy's has always taken the cake, metaphorically, and had the best spicy nuggets around. Let's all cross our fingers that the spicy chicken nuggets we know and love are here to stay, and more importantly, become a national menu item once again. Bacon Mushroom Melt Oh, 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 they didn't have the bacon cheddar cheese melt flavor. Wendy's decided to give the famous fungi a spot on the dance floor and bring to life one of the best things to ever grace fast food restos and drive throughs a single sizzling meat patty covered with classic American cheese slices, a hot, delicious, cheesy sauce, because you can never go wrong with more cheese, see the queso trio, and of course, salty mushrooms and crispy bacon reign supreme. All of this between two pillows of a Kaiser bun and you've got a blessing on your plate. Cue angels singing. So what was Wendy's thinking when they discontinued this magical item? They're out of their minds. We'll simply never know, but there seems to be a glimmer of hope. In January of 2022, Canadian Wendy's locations brought back the bacon mushroom melt. Though yet again, Wendy's is claiming this to be a limited time run. We have to think this spells out the possibility of a bright future for this unique burger. Wendy's hears the fans, and maybe they're testing our true appetite for it. Hopefully folks north of the border come out in droves to give the bacon mushroom melt the love it deserves, and that just makes might spark a comeback stateside. Monterey Ranch Chicken Sandwich No, not a chicken sandwich! Remember when we said that bacon is the top topper? You guessed it, it was one of the star flavors of this sandwich, too. What's so special about another fast food sandwich with bacon, you ask? Well, the OG Monterey Ranch Chicken Sandwich was made to impress. With a house-made bacon ranch dressing, thick, juicy breaded chicken breast, and Monterey Jack cheese, and whatever garnish you asked for, this one brought the house down. One of the most popular menu items of its time, this deliciously meaty sandwich on a Kaiser roll was the perfect satisfier for someone looking for an alternative flavor from the traditional burger, but who still wanted a delicious sandwich. That's smart. Sometimes the good times don't always last, and sadly, this delightful sandwich was taken off the menu. Some people posted reviews saying that the sauce was too strong and overpowering the simple flavors, or that they simply didn't go together. And we have to wonder if this is a reason that Wendy's brought the hammer down on this saucy star. Unfortunately, for those who loved this sandwich, it seems like the loud voices of the few who disliked it got their way. We're open 24-7, so tap or click another great video and hit that subscribe button. And hey, leave us a comment.